What up, everybody? Did I manage to get a PS5? No, not not currently. No, I don't want to play Among Us. I don't even know what that game is. Yeah, thousand dollars. I'll shave my beard off. Uh, is there a moderator in chat? Could you go ahead and ban the word Among Us in that combination, please? Please. What do you think of Woody Gamer getting his wife? I don't care what Woody Gamer tag does to his sexual life. What does it mean to have a gag reflex? It means you, you go up. because like any channel that I make won't have any kind of viewership. And viewership is and viewership ad revenue is based on your channel experience. So you, like you build up your ad revenue, and it's worth basically nothing. I've always been more of a support player. That's why I'm always really good at camping. I've never played with Kyle, honestly. Like even even like when we did PK, I think I've played maybe in total. I think I played less than 15 hours of video games with Kyle in my life. Did I try to buy PS5? They're not, oh, like, I, when, when 10 o'clock rolls around, I'm going to jump on GameStop site and see if they pre-order them. Because they said they're doing physical and um, online orders today. So, but look, look like, it, it's refreshing. It says, relax, please don't refresh or start the new session. You're in queue to join us this exciting event. But, like, I, it's refreshing me instantly. Let's watch this bullshit. We're going to switch over to just chatting. We're going to chill out here until we, uh... Get this done. Oh, by the way, here's my chicken biscuit. Hey, I mean, anybody else is on this? I'm not refreshing. It does it automatically. Like, honestly, like, I'm not refreshing. Dog, <laughs> I'm not refreshing. Like, look, here's my hands. Rocco's not refreshing either. I poop like rabbit poop since I had the surgery. I don't, I don't have solid poop anymore. Shoot, I've already been to GameStop and shit. GameStop, I rolled by GameStop and there was like 13 people there. That's what I counted. And there were more people pulling up, and I looked on the door, and the door was like four out of four disc consoles ready to go. I'm like, oh, same. I got girly hands, like PS3 controller. Fits my hand perfectly versus like PS4 controller. PS4 controller is about the same size. Honestly, it's just a little thicker. Uh, slow mode makes it so people can't spam the chat with different things. Makes it easier for mods to uh, moderate the chat as well. No, I, my wife asked me what I was doing, and I was telling her I was waiting in line for my PS5. Like the, the whole idea of the slow mode is to just keep people from spamming like photos and shit from like troll stuff. Why don't I talk to her? She's at work. She can't talk on the phone while she's at work. She can text. She can text with her her watch. What does a wings meal look like these days? Like um. I had a medium sweet tea and a chicken biscuit this morning for breakfast. Well, my reaction if Hulk Hogan died right now, like, honestly, I wouldn't care. Not available. What the flying fuck, dude? <laughs> like, I was here within the first 30 minutes. What the fuck is the point of signing up for notifications? Like, honestly, I was here before the... Ah... <sighs> Like, why'd they even put you in a queue if you weren't in queue to get one? Real talk. Real talk. Yeah, it's already sold out. That bitch is a gone. Ain't no reason to pre-call the, the call in the store is just like, I don't want to deal with you. Call somebody else. That's what the call in the store is. It's like, they said yesterday they are going to have in-store pre-orders and on their website yesterday. I don't think they had any on their website. Honestly, I don't think... They had anything on their website. Like I was under the impression that it would like it would take me to the website and take me straight to the PS5 pre-order. Not that just like like I was in the queue to get on the website itself. <laughs> yeah. First off, nobody gives a fuck about Wings of Redemption. The funny fact is, GameStop actually paid me for an appearance fee at my local store before. I got paid fifty dollars to show up and hang out and play video games at a at a COD uh, at a COD release. Like um, I had a connection in North Carolina that would that would basically steal games and you'd sell them under the table and stuff. Let me go and make me a tweet here. Twitters, dog, fuck GameStop. Honestly, fuck them in their stupid asses. Like I can't think of a company more deserving of Chapter Eleven bankruptcy than GameStop. They need to go the re the way of the dodo bird. And Radio Shack. I think it's bullshit that they're increasing the game's $10. Honestly. And here's why I think it's bullshit, right? 
a lot of games will put the price at $69.99 and not be worth a dime over like 30 bucks. The GameStop page here. And it says not available. If they're bullshitting me, because I'm, I'm honestly not in the in the in the idea that I'm actually going to get one today. I don't think that's going to be the case. Oh man! Uh, I'm looking for this bundle. Where would I find bundles on the things? Oh, 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 oh. What? Why? Motherfucker! But like most people are going to be like, well, my PC looks that good. <laughs> That's what they're going to be like. <laughs> That's all it's going to be. It's going to be like 200 extra viewers claiming that the PC is better than the PS5. Motherfucker, I want to break shit <laughs> from GameStop. Fuck GameStop. I would like to slap every pop figurine you have on the fucking floor and watch your fucking district manager have to pick them up while he grovels to the fucking corporate overlords that's rushing headlong into fucking bankruptcy. Fuck you, GameStop. Fuck everything that looks like you. Fuck the shutter that protects your store at night from the wind and the rain. Trade Bailey for a bundle. Bailey! Rocco. Think you're worth a bundle of uh, PlayStation? <laughs> Why are you laying under the chair? I'll see you guys either later this evening or tomorrow morning. Hope you guys had a wonderful time. I'll be back out here if we if there's any news on the PlayStation. Fire it back up. See you guys later. For those of you don't know, tow truckers make a commission off of every car they tow, right? And like there's times where he like he could be more lenient. Name's Crandon, And he decides Crandon. not to be I because he wants to make that money. Here. Me and my brother was, at one point was gonna start a, a tow of trucking company. Down in the we got sewers so causing trouble. They ain't packing too much iron, but I'd like them dealt with all the same. It got to the point where we were going, we even had a uh, flatbed truck that we had. Let's see. Just check to see if Fort Bay is still after being crushed by your newly gained weight. Good job, Sam. Your lazy excuse to, to, eat, to eat right post-surgery killed Bailey. Bailey is fine. She's sleeping with her mama. and we, I didn't actually roll over Bailey. She was just scared from me moving suddenly. Let's see, does Lexapro mess with your sex drive? I heard of those types of med scans. Yes, it does. I don't know, like... My grandmother took a turn for the worst today. And, um... Kind of messed up and can't sleep. But, like, she woke up today and she can't talk. So, me and my wife went and visited. And, like, it's something I don't ever want to see again in my life. And it like made me do a lot of reflecting on life and I've been doing a lot of reflecting on life yeah she's pretty much went into like full-on like she, she still is cognizant like she can like smile but she can't talk and like she's lost the most control of her body my grandma had has stage 4 lung cancer and she also has cancer in her pineal gland I think that's how you say it. It was stage four and we left it unchecked. Like we got, we just canceled all treatment because once you get to stage four, you pretty much um, have zero chance of survival. Like it's, a ma it's not a matter of if you die, it's when you die and how long it takes. What I thought was happening is um, they were worried about the lung cancer traveling up to her brain and I think that's what happened. Like, she's lost tremendous amounts of weight over the last few months. Like, she's went from uh, 130 pounds. I think she weighs 88 pounds now. I'll see you guys later. Good night.